Hello my friends, this is Splish and I hope you're having a great day and that you're gonna enjoy this Planet Side 2 video because I have been spending more time again playing Planet Side 2 and as always I'm really having a good time. But now when I've been playing more I also start to think about things that can sometimes be well, not only on the good side of things. And this is a bit controversial. I've seen a lot of discussions through the years when it comes to the infiltrator class. The good things and the bad things and foremost the possibility to stay cloaked. Sometimes for a short period of time or and almost infinite. When I started to play Planet Side 2, I played as a sniper, quite some mini infiltrator and using a sniper rifle because I usually play as a sniper in most shooter games and I still do that once in a while also in Planet Side 2 although I have discovered and now played more with other classes such as the Light Assault class which I really like here in the game because when you do that you also start to see things from another perspective you might say from the other side and when I once again started to play as an infiltrator I thought that it meant sniper class sniper only uh, but I learned uh, the hard way I must say that that's not the case You can play, for example, with an SMG or a pistol, a uh, knife only or something, being an infiltrator. Play like a ninja behind enemy lines or a flank character for that sake. I must say though here in the video, I haven't tried that kind of approach in the game yet myself. It's probably super fun, but I have to say I got a bit surprised when I realized early on that you were able to use the infiltrator class not only uh, using sniper rifles, but you can slap on an SMG or a pistol for that sake or going knife only or something using it. And of course, once again, it can be a lot of fun. But for me, especially when I got into this match where half of the freaking enemy team were playing like this, it kind of threw off the balance when it comes to playing the objective, if that makes sense. And I'm not saying that it shouldn't be there once again if a certain meta or for that sake not being a meta but a certain gun or ability is in the game you are able to use it and you should if you want to everyone should be able to play the game exactly as he or she wants to uh, but i just feel from my perspective once again that if cloak is a thing in the game i just feel that it one either should be only assigned to actually playing as a sniper but second if you should be able to play as an infiltrator using the camo feature, also using other weapons, then I think we should talk about the actual duration of being cloaked, maybe the cooldown itself, and things like that. I have been reading forums and the discussions that has been ongoing as expected for quite some time when it comes to the cloak ability or and the infiltrator class. The infiltrator class is, especially from some people's perspective, a bit underwhelming when it comes to just being able to take out infantry and maybe spot an enemy or two on the map compared to for example an assault class that can do the same in certain way but also being able due to the rocket launchers and so forth being able to take out vehicles i don't know if that's something you have been thinking about again everything i'm saying and talking about in this video is up to a discussion i am as mentioned before not a veteran in this game and i am all ears when it comes to your opinions and thoughts regarding a topic like this so let me know in the comments what you think i've heard the discussion also regarding the actual play style how you play the infiltrator i think a lot of people have talked about playing it the right way i'm not really sure what that is but i kind of understand a bit what they are aiming for because you gotta start to understand that if you're playing like that you have to adapt a certain play style and be very how should I put it, sensitive when it comes to your surroundings. I would say that goes also with my kind of background overall playing as a sniper. You have to be very perceptive and to understand uh, something about the, the kind of movement of the enemies and, and your shortcomings. I guess that's just a few of the things that probably will make you more successful playing that kind of playstyle using camo in a game such as Planet Side 2. I guess one thing that people would say when it comes to the ability of being cloaked in the game, not invisible but cloaked at least, as you've seen probably now all over the video when it comes to the clips here, is of course that you don't have the armor, the same armor ability as an, let's say once again, assault class. So you gotta bear that in mind and therefore be a bit more cautious I guess. It 
it's once again quite interesting when you have been playing a game for a certain time when you start to find things that you haven't really thought about from the beginning maybe it did occur to me definitely since i have been playing fps games for a very long time but it has been becoming more clear to me that I, okay, I have actually been thinking about this and I have an opinion. I'm not saying that they should take out Cloak entirely in the game, but it would be interesting to even think that far. What would happen if there was no Cloak ability at all in Planet Side 2? I'm just going far out here and I want to hear from you. Would that make a big difference? Well, probably. But would it destroy the game or would it be such a big thing that a lot of people wouldn't play it any longer? I don't know. I am the new guy here, so let me know once again what you think in the comments. And I also, of course, want to say thanks a lot for watching. I really appreciate the support. And of course, also, if you like Planet Side 2 and other FPS games out there, it could be new, old, and also indie or AAA, make sure to subscribe to my channel, turn on the notification bell, and we'll see you soon in another video. Oh, by the way, there's an event going on right now, I think from, well, today when I'm posting this video, Surf and Turf. Isn't that what it's called in Planet Side 2? I have to take a look into that as well, and maybe make a new video. Later, my friends.